morning. My name is Shannon Kersey and I am honored to serve as the proud principal of Alpharetta High School. It is my pleasure to welcome all our freshmen and sophomores and their parents to our campus on Information Day this morning. We have adjusted our typical program this year, whereas we usually start off as one large crowd in the gym for orientation, today we have spread everyone out so that all our sophomores and freshmen are starting off in your first period classroom. I know some of you may be standing, so I'm going to keep my welcome message short. On behalf of the entire Alfreda High School esteemed faculty and staff, please note we are so glad you are here. We know that many of you have not been on campus in classroom since March of 2019. Many of you attended school virtually all last year. So we know it is a big deal for you to be here today and we welcome you to Raider Nation. Each of you should have received a program that will assist you with navigating your morning as well as your understanding of how our school is organized. Please take a close look at that pamphlet. We are a large school, currently with over 2,200 students enrolled, but we work hard to help all our students feel connected and build community. We want each and every Alfreda High School student to feel excited about coming here every day. The most important ingredient to make that happen is to feel connected, discover what you are interested in, and find others who share that same interest. I encourage each of you to go by the cafeteria today for the activities fair and learn about many of the clubs, activities, programs, and sports that we offer our students. Please take a look at your Information Day program and find the list of 2021-2022 student support teams. Here you will see how we organize our support. Based on your last name, you may highlight the members of our faculty who will be your most direct support. Of course, we are all here to support each and every one of you, but for more individual needs and closer monitoring of academics and behaviors, each student is assigned to one primary administrator and one primary counselor. Stop by and greet your counselor today upstairs on the top floor outside suite 1320. Students, this past year has been extremely challenging, and whether you learned virtually last year or came to campus, last year's learning experience was far from normal. We are hopeful to have a more typical school experience this year. I know many of you may be nervous. I want to assure you that we are all here to support you, and we will work hard to keep all our students safe. To combat COVID-19, we encourage all students to bring your own water bottle to school each day and keep hand sanitizer with you to use regularly. For those individuals not vaccinated, we strongly encourage you to wear a mask. We will monitor the level of spread and if it reaches more than 100 per, per 100,000 residents, we will all be required to mask up at Alpharetta. Currently, masks will be required on the bus. Above all, students, please do not come to school if you are ill. We have removed attendance penalties and attendance expectations for exam exemptions to ensure our students do not attend class unnecessarily if feeling ill. Let's please work hard to keep each other safe. Students, please know your parents and every educator in this building want you to be successful. And the good news is we are excellent at what we do. We have an outstanding faculty and we are all here for you. Students, as Raiders, I challenge you to make a commitment today to make your high school experience amazing. Take risks, meet new people, try new activities, and make new friends. Above all, be kind to each other and know that you will be supported in Raider Nation. Once our welcome video concludes, students and parents, you are free to walk around the building at your own pace. Students, you may walk your schedule to ensure you know the location of each of your classes and you may meet and greet all your teachers. In each classroom, you will be able to pick up the suggested supply list for that course. You may purchase a locker electronically using the QR code in the program and then go to the auxiliary gym to pick your locker and get your combination. Then you may go find your locker and practice opening it. You may place lunch money in your account, 
purchase a yearbook, join our amazing PTSA, and make a donation for our amazing teachers. Above all, have fun today. Get familiar with our campus, find a club or activity to join, and walk away feeling better prepared for school to start on Monday, August 9th. Thanks for being here today, and go Raiders! Hi, and welcome to Alpharetta High School. We are excited to see everyone back this year. My name is Cindy Garcia, and I am PTSA president. I have a freshman at the University of Georgia, a junior at Alpharetta, and an eighth grader at Webridge Middle. Our PTSA is dedicated to meeting the needs of our entire AHS community, but that support only happens with your financial contributions and volunteer help. There are many ways you can volunteer throughout the year. Some of them are one time and some of them reoccur every month. If you would like to help out, look for our emails and our social media posts concerning opportunities. The best way you can provide support to our staff and students is through financial contributions. Being a member of PTSA, your tax deductible donation will help many PTSA programs for the year, including mini grants, student support, and staff support. Please join the PTSA through our website at ahsptsa.org or mail the membership form that was included in the mailer from AHS. Thank you. Hello, and welcome class of 2024 and 2025. My name is Austin Huang, and I'm the president of the Alfreda High School Student Council, and it is an honor to be able to speak to you today. It is my pleasure to welcome you to this amazing school and to give you some advice on how to make the best use of your time here at AHS. I still remember the first day I came here as a freshman, hearing the same exact speech as sitting with all of my friends, excited about high school, but also nervous about being in such a new and chaotic place. High school is a wonderful opportunity for you to grow and enjoy new freedom and independence, while also pursuing what you enjoy and like to do. It will be up to you to seize these next four years and take advantage, while also making sure to have fun and enjoy your teenage years before you officially become an adult. The greatest piece of advice I can give you all is to absorb every part of high school. I know it can be scary. High school is a big place with lots of new and unfamiliar people. It can be intimidating, frightening, and even downright petrifying. Even for those of you who have been here for all, already been here for almost a year, coming in person with 2,000 students is truly a unique experience. However, I promise the best way to live in high school is to go out on a limb and take risks. Seek out something new, explore the many different opportunities we have here, and step out of your comfort zone. That can mean joining a new club, like I did my freshman year. It could also mean having conversations, becoming friends with people you have never talked to. It can mean trying out a new sport or picking up a new instrument. It can mean talking to your teachers and asking them for advice on how to get through school or just life in general. I also want to encourage you to take the time to get to know your teachers, your counselor, and your administrators. I can personally tell you that much of the reason I'm here where I am today is because of my teachers and advisors who believed in me and helped guide me. High school is a place where you can get much more freedom, and the best way to take advantage of this is to be involved and live outside of your comfort zone. Get involved in extracurricular activity like student council, band, or color guard. Or maybe you have a passion for sports. You can join one of our many sports teams like football, volleyball, tennis, fencing, wrestling, just to name a few. Or if academics is your forte, get involved in one of our academic teams like NHS, Beta Club, etc. The point is, do something that makes you a little bit uncomfortable. Test the waters and see what is out there. I promise you, with how amazing the school and community are, you will not regret it.